What do we stick in it? Do we stick an iPhone? Oh, it looks like we did, didn't we? Huh? Welcome back to my second channel, guys. This is uh, this is my basement right now. This is where I always do the mail times. It is a mess. I mean, we got a box of shotgun shells here. We got a random slim, and here we have us thinking AK. 75 round drop. Why do I even have this? Well, let me just try to clear out a spot a little bit. It's really messy down here. This is, I don't know, guys. It's its not its not clean. Let's just say that. But we're going to do a mail time anyhow. But anyways, we're just going to go ahead and jump right into it. Right here, we got this. This is from Bruce Brett's all the way up in uh, DE, Delaware, I think. Maybe. Maybe not. <clears throat> Let's see. I need a knife. Here we go. We'll use this one. We used to use this one a lot. Some old kitchen knife or something. In this one, we have, it is professional wrapped oh what in the oh what is this oh this is cool and it smells crazy too <gasps> so this is actually from one horn supply and what this is is it's kind of like a rod sock but it's like it's a heavier it's kind of like a it smells weird guys I just <laughs> it's like a really long rod sock but it's also got a thing where you can put your reel into this in here for bait caster so I'm sure we can we got plenty of bait casters we can we've definitely bought some of that Next up, we're going with this one right here. It is wrapped in Rock Auto Parts box, so that's definitely a good one coming in hot. It is from a name unknown, unless your name is O Head, but I don't know if that's your name or not. Maybe it is. If it is, hello. Okay, there we go. We're getting it cut now. In this box, there's some fur jumping out at me. Let me just tell you that. We have an old looking fox squirrel tail. Still got the meat on it, and his name is Oakley Head, and in the letter, it says he is 4.5 years old. Oh, very interesting number. Moving right on to this one. This is a pretty head one, heavy one, okay? It says, open on camera say, same day you get it. Okay. Well, I hate to break it to you, but... And that is from David Matz. I hate to break it to you, but... We're about 10 days off. Let's just hope it wasn't alive. Because if it was, well, it may not be anymore. I don't know how to open it. I don't think anything's going to jump out at me, because it's probably dead by now. Okay. I think we're good. I think I don't think there's anything alive in here. Oh, we do got some weird stuff though. We have this right here, which is a here's a Kindle treat. I have no idea what this is. A nut roll or something. We got some yum dingers in motor oil color. That's good. Then we got some in watermelon red. A gigantic bobber and some jig heads that we can use basically any way we want to. Mm, moving right on to this box, we got this one coming from Ethan Drury. It says surface transport only which is something to do with don't put it in airplanes i don't know what that means hopefully it's a gun maybe i don't know i'm just kidding there's nothing in here but there is something i haven't figured out what it is yet it, it's square what is this no someone sent me an iphone hello yeah, there's, it doesn't work. Let's see what the letter says for this thing. I mean, I'm about positive they're probably going to tell me to shoot it with something, which we can make happen. What we got here, it's some kind of iPhone. I don't know which one it is. It is a white one, maybe a four or a three. I think it's a four, though. There it is. I mean, to be completely honest, it's, it's in pretty good condition. And I do have to congratulate you on uh, not breaking it while you had it. That's what, uh, that's what usually happens to me. Shatters them every time. Okay. This is from Ethan. I want to know how old he is. As I suspected, we got to shoot this on camera. Hey, man, I am, I am, I am, I'm all about it. I will shoot this multiple times. Did he say what with the... Let me read this one more time. Did he give me a specific gun? I saw one of your videos that you wanted to get a phone and shoot it. So I sent you this phone to shoot it. What a man. This is my kind of Ethan right here. You can get a charger for the phone at Walmart. Oh, it's one of those. I don't even, they definitely don't make those anymore. Do we want to turn it on though? That's the question. Do we want to turn it on? Yeah, I think we charge it and then we just blast it. What do we blast it with? That is the question. I think it's up to me though. This in here coming from Thorn, all the way from West Virginia, in a very unique color packaging. I usually don't get this kind of packaging if you look around. Let's see what we got, what we got, what we got, what we got. Insert American patriotic music here. There's a flag. And a skateboard. It landed. Yes, sir. All day. Kickflip. 
Mm, yes, sir. It's got an alien on the bottom, which is really cool. Also, we got some coffee scented worms. Those are really good. A dude, I think his name's John, but I'm not sure. And then some kind of trapezoid made out of marble. And then of course we got a bunch of pictures of him with fish, 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 and more fish. This is why we have problems with mail times, guys. Like I get the stuff and I, I don't know where to put it at the moment. So it uh, kind of just starts stacking up right here, right out of frame. And uh, I'll be honest, we're, we're just going to keep it going, okay? We're going to see how big that we can get this before it actually topples over on possible Here's something. It is from Jacob Junta, I think. Something like that. It is something cool that I don't know what it is just yet. It is made out of wood. It looks like some kind of wings. And it has the KG symbol right up top. This is art. Bob Ross ain't got nothing on Jacob. Conan Gentry. Hope I didn't, hope I didn't cut it. Oh, okay, I, I didn't. We got a, we got a couple fishing baits and two worms. See him? No, you don't. Dylan Edwards. We're going with the no looker hoper. That could have ended really badly if I just moved my hand over a little bit more to this side. Could have lost a finger. Again, some assorted fishing allures. So we look like I got a popper on this side and a frog on this side. A little bit. I just dropped the camera, but I saved it. Sweet. I was trying. I was just trying to get. I was just trying to give y'all a closer look, and well, you almost got a real close look at the ground. We're looking at here. Well, this one's just coming from Hopper. That's the only name we got on it. Don't do that. Don't try these knife tactics at home, kids. I'm a professional. Oh! <laughs> In this box, we got some dog treats, and on the front it says four peanut and lucky. It's, it's kind of funny because we've not had Lucky in over a year. We're just going to act like that didn't happen. Then we got a flashlight for whenever it gets dark outside or the power goes off. And then we also have this. So I can blow stuff up. Sawyer O'Hara or Ohana or Oma, I don't know. Oh, man. Oh, snap. We got some, oh, oh. This is a good one. This is a good one. First off, we got us a hat right here. It says give so or something on it not really sure what it says on it but it's a pure black hat which is unique but then we also have some craftsmanship coming in right here we got some kind of fur i don't know what that is maybe it doesn't look like a, it's the size of a rabbit but maybe a muskrat maybe a rabbit maybe it smells good though which is interesting it is about the size of a rabbit so i'm gonna just say it's rabbit but then in this little bag right here we got some more goodies let's see what we got in the in this bag right here we have a couple awesome things the first thing is some bullets these are some 22 blazers 50 rounds of ammo i'll go ahead and pull some out for you that right there is what we're looking at guys 50 straight up rounds this now this this is what we're talking about we can we can 112 percent put them to use then we got a rattle trap and then we've even got a knife here this is an uncle henry i wonder i've never heard of these people i've never heard of it before oh it's made by charade limited edition 2019 that's cool i'll show it off to y'all a little bit right there it is it says uncle henry right there on it good little trap or knife for sure but i'm not done yet but i'm not done yet we got this one right here from stony timmons but before we do move on to that we got a couple more over here i want to tell you just a little bit if you want to buy some merch right now we're in the long sleeve fishing shirt on the website right now, we're actually doing a like, it's a special deal. It's the KG Spring Fishing Sale. We've been doing it for the last couple years. All you gotta do is use a promo code and everything fishing related on the website is 10% off. The code for 10% off is KG Spring 10 all caps right there. That's what you gotta do guys. Everything fishing related, that even means that the new baits, that the new yeet worms and the spinner baits, the tackle bags, the fanny packs, the tackle boxes, all that good stuff, even the fishing shirts, all that's just 10% off as long as you use that code. Let's so go ahead and do that guys at kennelgrade1.com slash shop or the first link in the description also if you want to send me any fan mail it should be also in the description as well let's go see what stony timmons sent me send me a stinking pipe bomb no not a pipe bomb it's okay oh got some worms and then something down in here oh what is this gunfight gunfighter gun oil well i'll tell you one thing there's a lot of guns over there and they definitely need gun oil 
That right there might even get used by the end of the day if we're gonna be honest. Looks like we got a couple more and we're still moving strong. This in here is coming from Shaw Thesis or Thigh. Something. Coming from Sean, I know that. Says fragile, which isn't good because I was holding the knife directly like this. We're gonna have to try a new approach. That way we don't accidentally destroy whatever's in here. Hmm, what is this? Okay, I've not opened the actual bag that it's in. But he said he created it with his 3D printer, so I don't know what it is yet, but it's probably gonna be pretty cool as, oh, that is cool. I do need to be very careful with this. He 3D printed the KG logo. I do need to be careful with this. Oh, snap, dude. Look at that. He 3D printed, 3D printed the KG logo. Can you imagine how long that took? And my name at the bottom. I bet that took, I don't know much about 3D printers, but it's not a fast process. I would estimate that anywhere between 30 and 40 years. So big shout out to Sean because, well, he's put a lot of time into that. Derek Dastishla, semi hand warmers. Oh yeah, we staying warm tonight. Rachel Bell, right here, son. Oh, another, whoa, what is that? Okay, it's two fox squirrel tails. I like fox squirrels, but we don't have a ton of them around here. But this right here is two of them. I really like how y'all send in the tails because it's kind of like you're giving me the right to your kill. You know what I mean? If not, that's okay too. I mean, like, this is the trophy of the animal. And you guys are presenting it to me. And I just think it's cool that the person who delivered this has absolutely no idea that there used to be a living creature in this bag. Those are really cool, and those are really healthy tails, too. Along with, I'm gonna guess 243, not looked at it. It is 243. Oh, and another one. This is also 243. It's actually from Brody Bell. I think his mom was the one that mailed it. And coming in last, but definitely not, not last either, because there's one more. Nope, there is. This is last, okay. Sorry for the confusion, but I'm confusing myself with just as much as you. This, I just wanna say this is a big box, okay? And I have not found a name on it, except for Kendall Gray, but I don't think that's their name. I think it's mine. But then again, I could be wrong. This could be from Kendall Gray, you never know. From what I can tell, yeah, that's about it. I can't tell anything from this box. Oh, never mind. No, from your Louisiana fan. A cool trap. If this has trap on it, I don't know if I'm too thrilled about opening. Is it a trap to get me? Is it gonna, is it gonna like, kinda getting skeptical. It does say Aloha on it, which is cool, but it's Louisiana. It's not Louisiana talk. I think it is a trap. Just like Admiral Akbar said himself. It's a trap. It's a trap. I don't think this is a trap. But it's got, if it's got money in it, that's one thing. And a bunch of stuff. This is from Parker. And there is Parker sporting a lot of KG fishing gear. He looks like he's got a hat on for sure, fanny pack, and a rod sock, and the socks themselves, and a ton of bracelets, which is great. Real antique trap. Oh, so there's actually a trap in here. We'll actually open it last. We got two bucks in here, which is also a great bonus. Oh, and some old looking fishing reel stuff. This is cool. There's a lot of old stuff, a stringer. Here we got just a bunch of worms. We did have a bunch of pellets in here, but they accidentally spilled out. Oh yeah, here's the trap. Let's see what we got here. This is the real deal. He said this is an antique trap, so that's gonna be good. Just by the feel of it, uh, I think it's a double long spring. Oh! This thing is massive. Oh, snap. It seems to be maybe a vector, if that's what they're called. They have a V in them, but this is a big trap for a big animal. You wanna, you wanna set it and set it off? Of course. What kind of question is that? I think I'll be, I think I should be able to do it off over my knee, maybe. Come on, come on, a little bit farther. Mm. Oh, okay, we're almost there. Okay, this is dangerous now. I've entered the point of no return about it. Mm. Mm. Okay, we're good. Come on, come on, set the trap, set the trap. There we go, come on, the jaw's down. All right, good, good, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going, don't get caught, 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 don't get caught. Oh, sweet, bro, we didn't get caught. There we go, antique trap is set. Now I think I gotta turn it this way for it to flatten out. There we go, all looking good, trap is set. What do we stick in it? Do we stick an iPhone? Oh, it looks like we did, didn't we? <laughs> I can smell the antique all over it. Now, as for the damage on the iPhone, oh, oh, 
Snap it, cracked it. He's. Wow, this damage is pretty good. He said to shoot this iPhone, but uh, well, I, I think I, I think I just dropped it in a trap. We'll turn this around. The front side doesn't look that bad, but then whenever you turn around, the back glass really took the impact. This is uh, this is uh, this is a good one right here. But boy, oh boy, I think it's still intact enough to shoot for sure. But uh, maybe the internals, maybe uh, I don't know jammed up a little bit anyways great gang i tell you what we're gonna do like i said there is a mound of stuff here i'm gonna have to, to figure out where it all goes here in a minute but i tell you what thank you for watching this mail time video um uh, have, have fun don't go outside i guess maybe stay inside i'm just kidding i'm not kidding stay inside wash your little hands um besides that peace out and but don't forget the spring fishing scale because it's a really good place to get a lot of money off. <laughs>